What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. My name is Kevin Brown, also known as Express Stories with a Z, and welcome back to Speak It, See It, Feel It, where you can speak your life into existence, you can see it becoming your reality, and you can feel as if it is already yours. So for all of you that are new to my channel, welcome, guys. My name is Kevin. I am a life coach. I talk all things spirituality, personal growth and development, and allowing me to help you become that greatest version of yourselves, all right? So for all of you returning subscribers, welcome back guys to another video. So in this video today, okay, we're gonna go over a scripting technique that you guys can use. Okay, this is gonna be a quick video guys, okay? Quick video, a scripting technique that you can use that can help you manifest what you want in your life, okay? This is a little bit different than just writing something down, okay? This is a little bit different, but I want you guys to give this a try, all right? So, first things first, all right? You gotta make sure to always have your pad and your pen, okay? Make sure you guys are using pen to write, not pencil, because remember, like I've said in a video before, your spouse, hopefully not your spouse, but your, somebody could come by and just erase it, right? If you told some, if you told your manifestation to that enemy, somebody you weren't supposed to tell it to, they could they could find that and come by and completely erase it. Okay, so make sure you're writing in pen. Not just that, because pen is permanent, and you're trying to permanently attract what you want into your life. Okay, now this is a little bit of a weird technique, but it works. It's pretty powerful. And anything with writing, um, in terms of law of attraction or anything like that, I've tried. I've had things that's manifested. I've had things that's taken, you know, that's taken time, but yet I see the little bridge of incidents and things like that. But I've tried a lot of things, <laughs> a lot of different things over my years after having my spiritual awakening and learning about the law of attraction. And I've always been a writer, okay? I've always been a writer. I am a published author, which reminds me, don't forget to pick up a copy of my new book, Poetry Is Me. You can get that in the description below, okay? You can pick it up on amazon.com, um, barnesandnoble.com, booksamillion.com. It's on a lot of on time, online retailers, okay? You guys will not be disappointed, I promise you. So I do know what I'm talking about when it comes to writing, okay? I am an author and I love to write, okay? Now, for this scripting technique, okay? It's, kind of, it's almost like a backwards scripting technique in a way, but let's get right to it, okay? This is what you guys are going to do, okay? It's, it's pretty much like a message to yourself, okay? Letter to self, future self, okay? Now we know, okay, I've told you guys this before and hopefully you guys are still following this technique, following these practices. Make sure that you are writing in present tense, okay? You need to make sure that you are writing is, you know, I am so happy and grateful to be living my best life. I have more than $50,000 in my bank account, in my savings, you know, just whatever it is, whatever you are trying to manifest, okay? Make sure that you are writing in the present moment, in present tense, as if you are all, it has already happened and it's happening right now, okay? So in your scripting letter, guys, your message to yourself, okay? You're gonna write a letter, okay? Ah, sorry, something's like itching on my back. Ah. Okay, so you're gonna, you're gonna write a letter to yourself from the future, right? Your future self, okay? What are you thanking yourself for, for the things that you've done over this court amount of years or time or whatever? Thank you, thank you for, for what I have done, right? For all the sacrifices I have made, that you have made to place you to where you are right now, okay? You're gonna write it in the present tense that has already happened, okay? Now, there's a few ways that you can do this. It doesn't have to, it doesn't have to be from yourself. You can also make this into a terms of letter from maybe a loved one, okay? For all of you, for all you ladies out there, okay, that's trying to manifest that guy, right? You're trying to manifest that love of your life. Maybe he got away or something happened, but you're trying to attract them back. Fellas, same thing. You know, maybe there's a female out there that you really, really loved and you lost her. You're trying to get her back. Something, okay? You can use this technique, okay? As a manifestation technique, writing the letter from your person, okay? I know it sounds extremely esoteric. <laughs> it sounds extremely weird, okay? But that's why you're going to do this behind closed doors. That's why you're going to do it to yourself for yourself, okay? You're gonna write this letter to your future self, or I'm sorry, from your future self, or from the person that you, want it to that you want to receive it from, okay? Now, if you're writing it, if you're writing this letter to yourself from that person, you wanna make sure that as you're, re as you're writing this letter, as you're reading it, you're reading it as if it's what you would want to hear from them, okay? Does that make sense? So if you, you're, you're writing it as you're them, 
and then you're reading it as it's what you want to hear it's what you are trying not trying it's what you are manifesting okay now the power behind this technique is what you're going to do after this is you're not going to just write it down in your book whoops you're not going to just write it down your book close it and put it away okay and then just read it every single morning kind of like with the scripting letter okay this is a little bit different what you're going to do with this technique is you're going to actually fold it up you're going to actually put it in an envelope you're going to actually put a post-it on it and you're going to actually address it to yourself okay sounds weird but give this a try it is very very powerful okay now after you do this okay you're not going to just go to the post office and mail it out yourself okay because then you are expecting for its return to come back to you okay and then you're gonna already pretty much you're gonna you're gonna know okay now the power what I want what I want you guys to listen closely closely to me now the power of writing this letter from your future self you know thanking yourself for all the things that you've done and you, you're so happy and grateful that you're living in your mansion or you have your your the, your dream car you got the plenty of money in the bank you got the, the wife the, the you know the husband whatever it may be Okay, you wanna make sure that you are feeling the energy behind that, okay? Because the feeling is in the secret. Okay, remember that, the feeling is in the secret. So how does it feel as your future self to have already obtained it? Or how does it feel to have received this letter from your person and to, re and to, and to read exactly what you wanted to read? Be in the embodiment of that energy. So you are now matching the vibrational frequency of that desire. Okay, remember, you don't attract what you want, guys. We always attract what we are. So you wanna be in that vibration already. You're already in it, you're already living in the vibration of what you are, and that is how you are going to attract it into your life, okay? Now, after you have posted it, you have written, you have um, folded your letter up, put it in an envelope, you know, you've written out your address, you're gonna give it to somebody else that you trust. <laughs> give this letter to somebody else, you know, um, a friend, a spouse, somebody, and have them mail it on their own behalf. But don't tell them to mail it the next day or even within the same week. You know, tell them, give it some time. You know, tell them to mail it whenever, but give it some time, okay? Now, the power behind this is that now you're setting and forgetting it, right? Now you're no longer thinking about what you have written. You're no longer thinking about that note, but you have already created the energy behind it, okay? Now, the letter's gonna come in the mail, who knows when. It could be two months from now, it could be three weeks from now, it could be six months from now. It, it, it all depends on when that person is gonna put it out. But when you receive the letter, you're going to, you're gonna look at it almost like, hmm, you know, where, where did this come from? You know, it's gonna, be, it's gonna be a little interesting. And when you go to read that letter, you're gonna have the vibrational frequency of that desire, okay? Now, this is super powerful because number one, you wrote it back in the past. Okay, you wrote it back in the past and then you let it go and you had already matched the frequency of it and you let it go. Secondly, now it's coming back around into your reality and you're reading it almost like you're reading it for the first time. And when you're gonna read it, you're gonna read it with that feeling like, wow, wow, this is really happening for me. This is really happening to me, okay? And once you do that, after you do that, just hold on to your letter and just keep it and then continue to take action and continue to do the things that you are working on for that manifestation, okay? Now, this is gonna speed it up, okay? Not only is this technique gonna speed it up, but it's also a repeating number year, remember that, okay? It is the year 2022, okay? Growth and expansion, okay? So use this scripting technique, give this a try, guys. Now that it's the beginning of the year, it's the beginning of 2022, you definitely go ahead and give this a try and and maybe you'll receive that letter in march you know or april and before you know it maybe you're already living in that manifestation you're already living in that desire and then you're going to receive the letter and be like really be like wow like actually i already have it and that is because you have done this technique you have trusted the process and then you have completely let go remember out of sight out of mind okay so if you're not if you don't see it if you're not if you don't really see it okay you're not going to think about it so that's why you're giving the letter to somebody else to mail it off because now you don't see it and you're not thinking about it. And before you know it, something amazing is gonna happen into your life, okay? So that is another law of attraction technique that you guys can try, okay? My name is Kevin, I am your life coach. Be sure to subscribe to this channel and give this video a thumbs up if it did resonate with you. And if you have tried this technique before or if anybody is going to try it, drop it down below in the comment section, okay? And I will see you guys soon in the next video for more Law of Attraction techniques. And until then, I love you guys. Peace.